Aloha! Welcome to Maneuvering Life with me, Esther. And today's video, I will be showing you guys how to make um, some nice fiber pillows and a bin bag, a very simple bin bag. And uh, on the first piece of uh, uh, pillow that I am making, it's that on the screen at the moment. That fiber pillow is really amazing. It's easy to make in under five minutes you just have in your nice little comfortable light pillow that material the white material I got it and uh, under one dollar yeah it's really it saves a lot on time and even money because normally pillows are sold for 500 600 and even 800 shillings but when you make your own you save on money and also you just feel fun having something that is customized by you made by you and for sure i tell you it's just five minutes of work and you really have a nice comfortable pillow for yourself unique one like that i'm already done just two minutes of putting in work and i'm um, sorted out yeah the feeling is amazing so it's really light and very huggable very comfortable and soothing it's just amazing i love 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 this pillow so i got the fibers and just filled in and it's really nice i love it i do i really do and the next piece of material i also got under a hundred uh, under one dollar that's a hundred kenyan shilling so yeah it's really a nice and big uh, material and just fell in love with it for when i saw it i decided i'll be making my daughter something nice off of it and the thought of a bin bag just came in so i'm trying to open the zipper on this and just fill in the fiber filling it it is just so simple you just have to fill in fill it in and then spread the fiber while it's in there just to have it all rounded and to just look amazing so right now i'm filling in filling in filling it fully then the corners you also have to put some kind of material to fit perfectly on the corners and give it a nice shape then i get to punch it a bit move it side to side turn it upside down just to ensure that it all all the fiber in it are well spread out yeah and the outcome i tell you is amazing and for sure my daughter loved it Thank you for watching. Enjoy the remaining part of the video and keep liking my program to give me the morale that I need and to keep me motivated. And now on the yellow material, it was also a, this one was a pillow case and I decided to just make a pillow off of it. And now I'm trying to stitch, stitch it on the one side that was left out then i'll simply fill in with the fibers and yeah i'll have a nice pillow because the ones that i've been using have i have had them for so long for so long and i decided let me just have a fiber pillow made by me yeah you know that feeling of this is made by me yeah that just gives me all the all the niceness <laughs> Sorry guys, I realized I had made a mistake and I had to re-undo the stitching, turn the material inside out, then do the stitching again. So that once I'm done stitching, I just turn the material the outside way out and fill the material in so that the stitch, the thread won't be seen. Understood? I hope you have. <laughs> so much guys for keeping to this moment keep watching and for
for the last piece I will be working on today is right on the screen and this was my go-to way of stitch. I really am not so good at it but I believe with time I will be very good at it. I believe in practice, practice, making perfect and for sure I will be, I will be. <laughs> so yeah, that is how I am doing the stitch. I don't know how it's even called, just my go-to stitch. Let me see.